All right, we'll pick Lara up again tomorrow morning at nine o'clock. I'd love to. Thank you for your trust, Mr. and Mrs. Meyer. We're going to take good care of Lara. We promise you that. All right, darling. See you tomorrow then. See you tomorrow, Dad. If there's anything, just give me a call. Your mom and I can be reached at home. Okay, I'll do that. So, Lara, what do we want to do first? Shall we have an ice cream? Or would you rather watch a movie? I'm a little hungry. Can we have something to eat first? I can make you pancakes. What do you think? That would be great. Thank you, Mr. Peters. Feel free to call me Martin, Lara. Wow, that tastes really great. Yes, my dad makes the best pancakes in the world. What do you always have to eat? Anything. My parents are vegetarian. That's why we hardly ever eat meat. What do we want to do tonight, Lisa? We can watch a movie. What are you thinking? Yes, I'd love to. Let's just go outside for a minute. We can play outside for a bit. Good idea. Marcus, what's going on here? What is supposed to be going on here, Lisa? What are you doing here with Clara? Eat an ice cream, you can see that. Hey Clara, I'm talking to you. How can I help you, Lisa? You can tell me what else you're doing here. I told you to get out of my life. I'm just here to have an ice cream with Marcus. Where is the problem? The problem is that you're up to something. I know it. What is it this time? Are you trying to steal my life again? No, I just want to have an ice cream with Marcus. Marcus, you don't believe that yourself, do you? Clara and I get along great. Where is the problem? Are you jealous? No, I'm not jealous. I'm trying to protect you here. Can't you see that? You know what? I don't care. You deserve each other. Have fun together. Thank you, Lisa. Who was that, Lisa? 
It's a long story. Marcus and I were together once. And then he lied to me and everyone else. That's why I broke up. And who is this Clara? That was the girl who wanted to steal my life. She acted like she was you. She said she was my sister. Oh man, you've got to go through a lot though. Yes, sometimes. Have you ever had a boyfriend? No, never. It's probably better that way, Lara. Boys only cause problems. Okay, if you say that. How was your life otherwise, Lara? What all happened? What do you want to know, Lisa? Preferably everything. Well, I grew up in an orphanage. I lived there until I was six years old. And then? Then I was adopted by my parents. They always took good care of me. I am very happy that they have accepted me. I believe you. What was life like in the orphanage? Strenuous. I had to sleep in the room with five others. Besides, there wasn't any good food. I'm so sorry for you, Lara. Don't worry. It's all good now. Did everything work well? Yes, Dad. It was very nice. Lisa took good care of me. Perfect. Lara is always welcome to join us. And you too, of course, Mr. and Mrs. Meyer. We'd like to invite you to dinner. Do you have time on the weekend? We're welcome to do that. Then we can get to know each other better right away. Thanks again, Lisa. I had a really good time. Me too, Lara. We should do that again soon. I think so too. See you soon. Come on, Lisa. I'll take you to school. Okay, Dad. Hey, Lisa. How was your weekend? It was very nice. Lara was with me. 
We played and talked a lot. What did you do like that? I was actually just at home. I need to tell you one more thing. We met Marcus. He had an ice cream with Clara. Marcus is a really bad guy. I knew it from the start. It's best we stay away from him. You're right about that. Come on, let's go in. Good morning, dear students. I've got good news. We're getting a new student again. That's Clara. She's in our class from now on. Please be nice to her. She went through a lot in last school. Clara, sit down between Lisa and Marcus. I'd love to, Mr. Coons. Thank you so much. So where did I stop? Oh yes, on today's topic. Please listen carefully today. Because we're writing a test next week. What are you doing here, Clara? I'm going to school. You can see that. Why are you asking so stupid? What are you really doing here? Mind your own business, Lisa. I don't trust you. Did you really think I'd just disappear? You thought I'd make it so easy for you. That was just the beginning, Lisa. You have no idea what else is in store for you. Prepare yourself. It's going to be tough for you. I'll show it to you. You're going to disappear voluntarily. Trust me, Clara. Whoever laughs last laughs best, Lisa. What's up, Lisa? Why are you crying? Clara is back. And she wants to make my life a living hell. I just don't want to get in trouble, Sarah. Lisa, don't worry. I'm going to help you out. We're stronger together. Clara has no chance against us. Thank you, Sarah. You're a really good friend. I'm here for you, Lisa. How long was Laura in the orphanage? A. Two years. B. Four years. C. Six years. Write a comment.